What's good y'all, Kyle Loftus here, 50 Tips for Filmmakers in 50 Days. Today we're gonna to talk about utilizing an external monitor. This comes in handy a, a ton of times, but especially when shooting outdoors in daylight. So as you can see here, um, in this kind of scenario, you know what? I'm in daylight, but not only daylight, I've got the sun behind me and it is very, very bright. So trying to see off the screen of my Pocket 4K, one, it's just really, really, obtrusive and obstructing like I've got this battery pack in the way um, it's a small screen and again the the overall NIT value is really really low we're talking about 500 um, to give perspective this P7 inch monitor this has 1200 NIT almost three times the amount of my Blackmagic Pocket 4k and essentially what this NIT or NIT is essentially doing is it's valuing the brightness level of the monitor so my monitor can be extremely bright which means that I'm not going to have as much issue or trouble seeing the screen when I'm shooting outside in broad daylight um, I'm gonna have a much much easier time kind of seeing my image on camera and being able to make a adjustments. Um, again, if I did not have this monitor, shooting outdoors would be extremely difficult. Not only that, but we're about shooting at different angles, right? So if I want to go with a low angle here, or maybe, you know, it's a, it's a high angle and I, I just can't get that high. Well, I can't even see what's on my monitor here, but by using an external monitor, you know, if I'm going low, I can see directly on my screen. If I'm shooting from way up high, Again, I can see what's directly on my screen. So using an external monitor really allows you to, to maximize on your skill sets, abilities, and equipment when shooting outside in daylight. 